going, it's going. What does that have to do with us being Flintstones in real life? We have to keep this a secret. Yabba dabba doo. Guys, it looks like the only hand that's working is this camera. Is everybody okay? I'm okay, but what is going on? Daniel set off an EMP in the house that's gonna shut down technology for 24 hours. Yeah, my laptop isn't working. Wait, my phone's completely off too. Wait, where's Robbie Rob? He probably got scared and ran away. Why did Daniel set off an EMP? Rebecca, RC Twin told us that the Kingpin has been tracking you using technology, but Daniel has a plan. Daniel! Yabba dabba doo, look what I got. Why did you bring Flintstones costumes? I'll explain everything in a second, but first get dressed. And also, look, I found this outside your door. Oh! Another Zamfam giveaway prize. Perfect. Let's get dressed. Zamfam, you guys know I have been ordering a gift for when we hit 10 million subscribers for a Zamfam giveaway. This is a Nintendo Switch. We go along with this giant flat screen TV and two new iPhone 12. Sweet. Can I take this one? It's for the Zamfam. Uh. For the giveaway. Zamfam, I know I have to turn into Flintstones, but I cannot believe that we are going without technology for 24 hours. You guys know I have been using this secretly to get rid of my headaches. The only thing that makes it go away. But now this isn't going to work. I don't know what I'm going to do, and the headaches are really bad. But don't tell Matt or Maddie or Daniel about this. I'm gonna have to hide it. They can't know I have this. Shh, just keep it our secret. Okay, Daniel, we're Flintstones now, so what's the plan? So when I was hacking into Al, I found this weird cryptic file with different symbols on it. And the Zam fam told me that these symbols represent earth, air, fire, and water. Aren't those the four elements? Yeah. What does that have to do with us being Flintstones in real life? Well, we're gonna be doing different challenges with no technology to activate the elements. What will happen if we do that? If we activate the elements and figure out the challenges correctly, the gym should glow and reveal a code. But we only have three gems. I think that there is a fourth gym hidden here somewhere. Okay, well, what element do we start with first? Well, the first symbol I did find was air, so I think that's what we have to start with first. Okay, let's, let's go. go. Okay, the only thing I can think of that can generate enough wind to make one of these gems glow are nunchucks. So let me go ahead and try it out. Pretty good at it now. Wait, Maddie, what is this? Get well soon balloons? Yeah, we got this for you when you were in the hospital before you got taken. Thank you. This is so sweet. Yeah, we have balloons, a tea party, mini brands. Wait, where are the mini brands? I love mini brands. But they were right there on the table. Me and Robbie Rob set them up. Seriously, is Matt using nunchucks right now? Not again. It's not gonna activate air. Ugh. I think they're glowing a little bit. It's working. Guys, I got it. I did it. Uh, I no, did it. it's not glowing at all. Maybe you guys have something better than that. Also, why are you guys wearing shoes? We have no technology. We still have shoes. <sighs> Gets one pedicure. Won't wear shoes now. I think the napkin challenge is gonna activate the air because it uses the air to float, and then when it goes down, the gems will start glowing. Give this video a thumbs up if you think this is gonna work. Three, two, one. Go! Go! Get it! <laughs> Are they glowing? No, but these Fruity Pebbles are really good. Probably would have worked if you didn't wear shoes. It's insane. I think the Coke and Mentos experiment should do it. I mean, the air in that pushes it way up. This has to work. The gems are right here. Comment below if you see any of them glowing because we need to get all of them to glow so we can get the four digit code. All right, let's do it. Why aren't the gems glowing? This should have worked. This was air. It got so high. We're thinking too modern. We gotta be more like Flintstones. Think more like naturally. Look, I think it's some paper would work. But Flintstones use stone. Let's just try the paper. Okay, fine. Barney, why did you bring us to our balcony? Fred, I need all of your help on this one. We need to make paper airplanes. We're gonna throw them over the balcony, over the gems, and hopefully the air will activate the air gem. Oh, and we'll be able to find out which of the gems is the air gem. Zamfam, comment below which one you think it is. Then we'll get that code. You think that'll work? I think so. Let's try it. Yeah. All right, Sam fam, smash the thumbs up button. Okay, so we have all of our air paper airplanes ready, right? Yes. Matt. Ooh. What? What's that? Sorry, it's a super trick airplane. Been doing this since I was a little kid. I didn't show anybody how I did it because it's a super secret. You know what? Let's just activate this gem, you guys, so we can move on to the next element. Three, two, two. one. Activate! Go, 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 paper airplane, go. Whoa, it's clear your gem. Go, it's so clear, go, 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 go. We did it. Great job. I think you should stay inside though. It's not safe out there. I let off an EMP. Why is Al activated? That doesn't make sense. We have no technology right now. You're right, Al. We, we will stay inside, but we're gonna go get our paper airplanes first. Come on, go, go, okay. go, 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 go. Guys, look, 
There's a seven. That must be the first digit of the four digit code, Daniel. Guys, we have to hurry. If Al's on, that means the kingpin can probably track us. But oh. we still have to find the other three digits and we don't know where the fourth gem is. You guys, Al is reprogrammed. She's nice now. She's on our side. We don't have anything to worry about. But she's on and there's not supposed to be any technology. So what's going on? Al is on and there's no technology. Yeah. Daniel just, just said, said that. you guys, there's a lot of different reasons. I mean, Al could have been reprogrammed in case there was something like this to happen so that she could still help us, yeah, okay? Yeah, but who reprogrammed her? I didn't do that. Well, we just need to keep continuing with these challenges. So we need to stay outside because if we go inside, then she can look at us and spy on us. Okay, well, let's just finish the challenges here, but I think you guys are worried about Al for no reason. We'll still continue, no technology, but let's just get the rest of these codes. But guys, we still don't know where the fourth gym is. We, we know! know. Alright, Matt, for the Earth challenge? Yes. I got a Great idea. Okay, what is it, Daniel? Uh, what comes from the earth that we slice? The grass. Fruit. What do we do that involves fruit? We eat it. No, Matt. The do, do the do. <gasps> fruit Ninja! <laughs> There's no way that Fruit Ninja is gonna activate one of the gems. Yeah, I mean, it's earth. We need something from the earth. Wait, what if we do like facials with it? That might activate the gem. Oh, like a charcoal face mask? Like, like a dirt face mask from the earth. It'll be fun, come on. I'm pretty sure that's gonna be the red gem, Incredible gem, because of how incredible Fruit Ninja is. Ooh, yours is this. so much better. I have the multicolor samurai. Wasn't this the sword you used when you were Gomez in Adam's family? Yeah, but I didn't unsheathe it like you just did. Oh, ooh. who's going first? I think we should rock, paper, knife it. That doesn't seem safe. Okay, Three, let's do it. Two, one. Rock, rock paper, knife. <laughs> How do you win that? You're going first. Oh, okay, cool. Okay, ZamFam, so we have to activate the Earth Gem element, and we think that by doing face masks on us, that that will work. You guys, comment below if you think it will. I know the boys are doing Fruit Ninja, but this is the Earth. This better work, because I do not want dirt on my face. Maddie, face masks are fun. I do it all the time. Not when it's dirt. All right, we're doing it. Oh, gosh. Oh. It's slimy. All right, I'm going to place the gems right down here. If we slice this correctly, and this is what's going to activate the gems, they're going to glow right down there. I'll Obviously it's gonna work. I'm going first, what am I slicing? An orange. All right, Daniel, you got this. Ready? Yep. Three, two, one. Slice ah! I did slice it, but nothing's happening. Okay, why don't you pick one for me? All right. Oh no, oh no, you just got mud on your dress. Oh, Betty. Sorry, Wilma. This is friendship goals right here. Two girls with no technology doing face masks with dirt. I say we go with this melon. Hey! hey. All right, Daniel, I'm gonna do Fruit Ninja level 11 right now. We need to call the boys over soon. We need to activate the gem. I think this might actually work. Maybe if we do some type of meditation, that that will activate the earth element. Like laying on the floor being one with earth? Exactly, Betty. Three, two, one. Where do you think Robbie Rob went? I mean, he was there and then he was just gone. Maybe he had like a pizza shift at Domino's? Zamfam, comment below. Do you think that we can even trust Robbie Rob? He just disappeared? I mean, I think we can trust him. Three, two, one. Yabba 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 doo! So we have the mud and we are adding leaves because we are gonna be turning in to the earth. It's not activating anything. They're just wasting time. They just like slicing fruit. They like being fruit ninjas. Hey guys, I, I think we need the gems now. I, I think we're one with the earth. We look like trees, Maddie. This was such a good idea. Maybe the girls have a better luck. Wait, what? Oh, they called us over. Oh, grab the gems. The gems! Where are you guys? We need the gems. Guys. Leaves what? on your face. Earth. Yeah, we became trees. We're gonna lay down. Maybe the gems will light up if we just relax, become one with the earth. Where do we put the gems? Just put it by our heads. Not on the oh, head. Oh, sorry, but sorry. By the head. Like right there. Yeah. Is it working? Is it glowing? The green one. The green one's lighting up. <gasps> we did it. We activated the earth gem. What number is it? It looks like a three. We're gonna go clean up, okay, you guys? No, no, what about Al? We'll be fine. We just have to wash this up our face. Yeah, it's not like we're gonna have a conversation with Al. Okay. All right, Matt, we uncovered these two gems. It got two numbers. Okay. We only have two more gems left. Two more challenges. But Daniel, we've already done two challenges. That's what you just said. You okay? Yes. Okay. I can't wait to get this off of my face. Yeah, no, it's definitely hardening. I have done face masks, but yeah, not a dirt face mask. I'll be in my room. Me okay. too. All right, Daniel, what do you think the next element is? Well, I think it's fire. So the first one that we had was air, and that was a paper airplane, and yep. it was clear. The earth was green. Yep, okay. I think that this one's probably gonna be fire, because it's red. Yeah, I said fire was next. Yeah, that's what I said. We are all cleaned up, and we only have two more elements to activate. I think fire's next. I have an idea. Oh. I know you have been using that device for your headaches. I can help you. But how can you help if we have no technology for 24 hours? Bring it down to the motherboard and it will work. To the motherboard? I'll make sure Maddie's gone so nobody knows. Okay, I'll try it. 
Okay, Sam fam, do you think Al is telling the truth? I mean, we have no technology, but she said if I connect this to the motherboard, it will work. And you guys know I have been using this for my headaches. I just can't let the others know that I have been using this. We have to keep this a secret, but I hope this works. I hope Al is telling the truth. Hey guys, I think the next challenge is gonna be fire. Yeah, I keep saying this. Yeah, right? Maddie, where, where were you? Beating me. Okay, well, do you guys have any ideas of how we can activate that gem? Maybe we have to start a fire. What could we use? Rocks. Maybe we should use a flint stone. Those are known to spark and start a fire. Oh, that's where the name came from. Okay, Sam Fam, Al said to just connect this to the motherboard and then it would work. Do you think this is gonna actually work? Just have to hurry before Maddie, Matt, and Daniel come back in. We have power. We have no technology for 24 hours, but the motherboard is somehow activating. <gasps> okay, Sam Fam, so if I can just lay under this light for a few minutes, my headaches will go away again and I'll feel better. Don't tell them that I'm using technology. Okay, Zam fam, that's all I need. It's off. All right, let's go. She was just behind me after we washed off. What? Maybe try to go to the bathroom. Okay. Hey oh, hey. hey. Sorry. Feeling good. Ready to go for this next challenge. Are these like goggles or something? What is that? Oh, these <laughs> must have gotten tangled with my necklace when I was washing Wilma? my face. Wilma? I don't know. I just felt right. Okay. okay, so Fred, you know how to start a fire? Yes, I do. Daniel, Rebecca, meet the Flintstones. It's just like two stones? We're supposed to make fire out of this? Yes, that's how they did it back then. I'm gonna use a stick. What are you gonna do with the stick? I'm just gonna rub it on stuff and it's gonna go on fire. Okay, Sam Pam, I have a great idea to light a fire for this fire gem. I am going to light this candle. Hello, Maddie. Ow. You guys, remember, we need to activate this gem. So, so far we have activated the clear gem, which was air, the green gem, which was earth, and now the red gem is fire. Okay. Spark it, spark it. I feel like we're just working with like in a town of bedrock right now. I Matt, no. you gotta go faster. I don't wanna spend 24 hours building a fire, you guys, and it's getting dark. We kind of need a fire. Where's Matt? You can use matches to start a fire. That's a great idea, but I don't have any matches. There is a pack of matches by the picture frame. Right there. You guys, my hands are getting tired. You're like, no. it's almost there. I don't think so, Matt. Okay, you guys, I know how to make a fire. A candle, nice one, Maddie. Yeah, we can. Oh, I got this. What? Not Matt, that's not working. No, not with I'm almost there. I have matches. Oh, yeah, that's not technology. That's so smart, Maddie. I How know. did you figure that out? Um, it just came to me. Ooh, fire. Ooh. It's going, it's going. Oh, oh. Wait, what is it? It's a six. A six, seven, three, six. So we've activated three of the elements. We just have to get the fourth and final gem, and the last element would have to be water. It's gonna be water, guys. So Zamfam, comment below where you think we're going to find the last and final gem. It has something to do with water, and we have to find it in the next 24 hours. We should go and look around, because I think it might be near water sources. Why don't we just ask Al? No, 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 no. Okay, I don't trust Al. I'll go distract Al while you guys go look around the house. Rebecca, you go upstairs and look at all water sources. Maddie, you can stay downstairs, and, and Matt, just you can be outside. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna go inside that giant pool that's been staring me all day saying, jump in! So if we find the water gem, what do we say so the others know if you don't want Al knowing? Who do you? Oh, yeah, but dab a dude. So I'm taking upstairs, Maddie's taking downstairs, and Daniel, you're gonna distract Al? Just gonna talk to Al. And Matt, you're gonna do the pool? Yes, I'm gonna look all around the pool and jump in if I have to. And then, one, two, three. Yeah, but dab a dude! Al, do you know who the Flintstones are? Do we match it? Do we look like it? Of course I know who the Flintstones are. You are Barney Rebel. Okay, Sam Pam, I have to check the water sources upstairs. Maybe this is it? The water's not working. Okay, let me check the other rooms. Maybe Maddie can let me guys. I'm gonna check all the sinks downstairs. Let me know if you see the water gem anywhere. Okay, oh yeah, that's right. We don't have power. The water's not turning on, but I don't see the water gem. Maybe this other sink. Water gem. I'm gonna look around the pool. Same fam, I need to find the water gem. And I'm looking all around this pool, but I'm not finding it anywhere. It looks like everyone is looking for something. Would you like me to help you? I can get the power back on. No, 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 that's okay, Al. Well, I can't see in the dark, so I can't help you. Oh, you can't see in the dark? All right, same fam, I went all around the pool. I did not see the water gem whatsoever. Comment down below if you saw it at all. We need to find this thing before Al finds us and sees us looking for the gem. I might have to jump in. Oh, it's blue at the bottom. Same fam, I'm pretty sure that this gem is gonna be blue, so it is gonna be impossible to find without jumping in. Give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe, turn on all notifications if you think that this is a good idea. And I'm gonna find the water gem inside of here. I'm the smartest guy in this crew. No one's looking. Time to jump in. This isn't working either. Oh, so you guys, that was so close. I wore the goggles. They almost found out that I was using that. That device. I played it off though, right? There's no way that they knew what I was doing. Zam fam, you have to keep this a secret from me, okay? It's helping my headaches, okay? So it has to be a good thing, right? Into the blue water. Okay, 
Zane fam, there's a hidden tunnel right by this pool where I found a samurai sword. I think I know where it's at. Yabba dabba do! Yabba dabba do! Matt, he yabba must have found the gem. It must have been outside of the pool. Uh, Matt, you found the last and final gem? Well, not exactly, but I think it's down in here. Well, it's getting dark, Matt. How are we supposed to go in there? That's like a tunnel and it's super dark. All right, I'm gonna go in right now. No, 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 wait, 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 hold on, hold on. I have a plan. Okay. I was distracting Al and she said that she cannot see at night. It's a perfect opportunity. I'm gonna slip away because I need to go hack. I need to figure out what's powering Al because there should be no technology. She shouldn't have any power. Well, what do we do in the meantime? After you get the gym, you guys need to stay the night in the tiny house. It's not safe for you guys to be inside. I don't trust Al. Okay, and then what do we do? I'll call you. By morning, I should have a lot more information about what is going on with Al. Okay, Daniel, good luck finding out what is powering Al. We're gonna find this last and final gem. All right, find it. You have a dab do, Daniel. Matt, are you really gonna go? Yeah, hold my glasses. So creepy down there. I just feel like this might be the only opportunity that we can get the last and final gem. Okay, Zan fam, wish us luck. We have to get this last and final gem. Oh, Steve. Matt, I don't wanna be out here at 3 a.m. Oh. Oh. Matt, are you okay? Let me grab something. Oh. Oh. Matt, can you grab it? You okay? Yeah. Yeah. I do not want to get trapped down there for 24 hours. Wait, wait, wait. It's so deep in there. Okay, let's okay. close that thing up. No joke, that was one of the scariest things I've ever had to do. But we got the last and final gem. It's not working, it's been in water. What if we bring this out to the pool at 3 a.m.? 3 a.m.? The air is the thinnest at 3 a.m. You guys, what if we put this in the water? Do you think that it will activate the gem and it will glow? I mean, we need to find the last and final digit. Matt, let's get you a towel, let's get to the tiny house, go to sleep, and then we can wake up at 3 a.m. and see if this works. You guys ready? Okay, Zam fam, so it looks like we are sleeping tonight in the tiny house. Luckily, it's not that bad, right? It could be worse. I mean, we could be sleeping outside. Just remember, you guys, we're gonna have to do our best to try to wake up at 3 a.m., but we don't have alarm clocks, we don't have phones, we don't have any technology, so we're just gonna have to hopefully wake up. That's right, Zam fam, we can't use any technology at all, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna rely on the ghost to tell us exactly where we need to put the final gem to show the number. And we're gonna use these dowsing rods. Have a dab a do, try not to snooze. We can't oversleep, you guys. <laughs> Rebecca, Maddie, wake up! Is it three? What time does it feel like? I don't know, it feels late. Maddie, I'm sorry you have to face your biggest fear, but we need to figure out how to activate this gem. The, the ghost might be able to help us, and we can't use the ghost app. We have to use the dowsing rods. Ghost, if you are here right now, help us out. Give us a sign that you are here. What does that mean? It's pointing that way. Okay, let's follow it. Plants? Uh, Something in the plant? Wait, one of my mini brands. I, I have that one out of the tea tree. Le, let's take them outside. We need to figure out how to activate this gem. Oh, Maddie, you have to ask a question. I don't want to. I don't want to talk with the ghost. Yes, you no. have to ask it a well, question. Maddie, will the pool help activate the blue gem? Yes. Can you show us where in the pool to place the gem? Okay, Sam fam, smash the thumbs up if you think that this is going to work and we will get the last and final digit to the four digit code. Three, two, one. <gasps> What is the number? I think it's a two. Okay, Sam fam, so remember that four digit code. We're gonna go back to sleep in the tiny house and wake up when the technology comes on, just like Daniel said, okay? All right, you guys, let's get back to the tiny house. Your phone ringing? Rebecca, Maddie, wake up, Rebecca, it's your phone. Oh, guys, it's it's Daniel. Hey, Daniel. Hey guys, I got the power back on. Thank you, Daniel. Obviously, because our phones are working. Oh yeah. How did you make out on finding oh, the code? We, we found the code, it's 7362. Well, what if Al isn't shut down? We need to input that into the system. Okay, thanks Daniel, we'll do that right now. Hey, Sam fam, so you heard Daniel. Our technology is back and turned on, and now all we have to do is enter in the four digit code that we found with the gems, you guys. Let's get inside. All right, let's go. Wait, what about the gems? You know what? Let's just hide them in a drawer here for now. Okay. They should be hidden here. Come on! Comment below who you think is behind Al. We're now gonna be able to figure it out now that we have the four digit code. Technology! Zamp him! Light! My phone! This is the best! We have technology! I'll be honest, that was the hardest 24 hours with technology ever. Zamp it looks like Daniel did it. Al's off! All we have to do is enter the four digit code. Okay, Zam fam, smash the thumbs up button so we can figure out who is the one behind turning on Al. Good morning, Rebecca, Maddie, and Matt. Technology has been restored. Where is Daniel? Daniel? 